thought we'd call in on the way to football, didn't we? How's Sarah doing? Yeah, she's okay. Yeah, apart from demanding spaghetti hoops for breakfast, which I had to drive all the way into town to buy. Oh, my hero. Well, um, Noah's got us some chocolate, haven't you? No, I don't. Yes, you have. I thought it was for me. You've had yours. When? Between the shop and here. I saw you stuff it in your mouth. Never seen a kid eat that fast. <laughs> well, hand it over. Here. And a smile would not hurt. Thank Excuse you. me. Oh, nick that from the factory before you got booted out, did you? OK, well, we're off to football, so call if you need anything, yeah? Aren't you forgetting the real reason you're here? Oh, what are you on about? You want to move back in, don't you? Not this again. Come on, admit it. There isn't room. I suppose she could squeeze in with me, if she asks nicely. Dream on. You want to move in, don't you, mate? Yeah, the house is full of girls, and Jenny tried to brush my hair. Oh, that is well bad, that is. That's not going to happen here. Debbie might try and brush your hair. She tried it with me once. Big mistake. But lad's ruling this house. Isn't that right, Cameron? That's our secret, Kane. Can we, Mum? Darling, this is not our home. <sighs> Please, get the message. I will never come crawling back to you. Goodbye. Why aren't you eating? Not hungry. <clears throat> Somebody upset you? No. Don't give me that, Jenny. I know you. What's Nick Hill done now? Nothing. Forget it. I'm just tired because somebody was playing music half the night. Well, I couldn't sleep, could I? No, nobody could, thanks to you. Will you just forget, Jay? You'll meet somebody else soon. She has. Oh, she will. She's that sort. I'm so sorry. Would you like a slap? I hate to admit it, but I think she's got a point. Aha! Thank you. Plenty more millionaires out there. Yeah, and I told you I only want Jay. Well, I reckon he feels the same because he is looking miserable. Is he? Yeah, he's trying to hide it, but I can tell. Has he said anything to you? No, but he did mention that he might be popping over the pub. You really do want to get rid of me, don't you, Jenny? <sighs> Come on. See... Jenny said he would be here, and he's not, unless she's lying, because I know she didn't like me. <clears throat> what? You! Sitting here, waiting for a bloke, talking about him non-stop, and boring the life out of us all. I never thought I'd see the day. Yeah, you took your time. Sorry? You forgiven. I'll have a Coke, please, Chas. You must have been expecting to see me. No, I wasn't. I'm here all the time. Made me sound a bit sad, didn't it? Must have been hoping for a, a little glimpse, at least. I just wanted a drink. But I don't anymore. Jay? Please, please don't go. I can't even be in the same room as you. Because you still love me, No, don't you? because I don't trust you. You all show, and it's all about the money, and there is nothing underneath. Now, you don't care about anyone but yourself. And I can never love someone like that. Jay, listen. Please, give me a chance. Will you meet me later at my place? At Jenny and Katie's place? Please. And I will prove to you that I am a lot more than that. He still loves me. Oh, give it up. You heard him. You want to make a show of yourself, you go begging for him to take you back. Well, I don't care. I am going to do whatever it takes. So what I need you to do is pick him up from football and then give him his tea. That would be fabulous. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And what are you up to? Oh, nothing really. Who are you kidding? And please keep Noah away from your dad. I know that's not going to be easy. But please make sure he doesn't say anything. I don't want Noah getting his hopes up about moving back in there. OK, well, I'll try my best, but you know what Dad's like. You do know that's never going to happen, don't you, darling? I mean, I love you to bits, Debs, I do, and you know that. But no way on this earth can I live with that man ever again. I bet you... Interrupting him. But he doesn't want to see you. Well, can't he speak for himself? Can't you get the message? I just need a minute. You're wasting your time. Well, I've kind of wasted half an hour waiting for you, so a couple more minutes is not going to kill me. You really think you can click your fingers and I'll come running straight back? No, it's not like that. 
I just thought you might want to hear what I've got to say. No, not really. Please. This is one of those times where we really need security. Seriously. I know that I've crossed a line with Nikhil, and I should never have done that. But I just wanted you all to myself. You wanted my business? No. Well, yeah, sort of. But with you, partners. I've got a partner. I know. And I've messed up big time. But I honestly don't care about that now. It's you I want, just you. Not your factory, not your money. You. No, well, it's too late. No, it's not. Jay, we can start again. Please, please forget what I did. I love you. I know I've never said that before, but... Since we've split up, I felt it. How convenient. No, it's not, actually. I don't like feeling like this. I don't fall in love with people. But you're different. Everything about you is different. I want to be with you more than anything. I don't believe you. Jay, I love being with you. I love you being a dad to Noah. I love everything about you in my life, so please, will you just forgive me? And marry me. You didn't just say what yeah. I did. I did. Marry me. What's going on in there? Nothing. Why have they kicked you out then? They didn't. They did. They're just talking. How long does it take to say yes? Yeah, I've done enough of that. And it cost me a fortune. Not this time. I've just told you it is not about the money. Well, then I don't get it. I know. It's hard to believe. I can't believe it myself, but I swear I meant it. <laughs> now, why would I even consider marrying you? Because you love me. <laughs> you think it's that easy? You think you can walk in here with your new game and I'll fall for it? Come on, Jay. You knew I was no angel when we got together. Neither were you. And... I don't remember you having a conscience about the fact that I was with Kane. And that's because I didn't like him. And you were flirting. Yeah, and we both like playing little games. Doesn't that show you that we're right for each other? No. It shows that we've got a death wish. And I'm pretty sure that I'll be the one that ends up dead. Eventually, yeah. I hate to break this to you, but everyone does. So what are you going to do till then? Are you just going to find some nice, safe, boring woman to settle down with? Is that what you really want? Or do you want fun and a bit of danger and excitement? I want real. I want honest. And I want someone I can trust. And that isn't you. So no, Charity. I won't marry you. What are they saying? No idea. We shouldn't be listening. Yeah, we should. Make sure they're all right. Why wouldn't they be? I don't know. I'm going to have a listen. Look, maybe you lot should all go home, yeah? Oh, no, you've got me worried. If you want to send us home, it must be bad. Yeah, well, you can all make up the time tomorrow. Uh, no way. We're not budging. So that's it. There's nothing I can do to change your mind. Okay. You are right, love? No, not really. Look, can, uh, can we all just get back to work, please? I told everyone they could go home. Yeah, whatever. Right, Pop? Anyone fancies it? I never see a no. You know what, before anybody goes anywhere, please, I just... I would like to say something. It's about Nikhil. Well, hang on, do you mind running it past me first? What are you doing? I tried to set Nikhil up. By mucking about with his orders and making him look like he cheated you all with your overtime. Why would you want to do that? I wanted to make him look stupid. Incompetent. We went on strike! I'm sorry. We could have lost our jobs! I don't think Jay would have sacked you, really. No, but...
but Nicky and I don't I need the money. Yeah, we all do. Well, like I said, I'm sorry, and if it's any consolation to any of you, I've lost Jay because of it. We well, don't expect any sympathy. I don't. I just thought you all had the right to know. I think you'd better go. Yeah. I am so sorry, everybody. Unless one were to ask. He never. Well, he seemed to have a sussed. Uh, she was playing him. Some blokes don't like that. Didn't bother you. She didn't do it, mate. You reckon? Did you actually go down on one night? No, I did not. I would have done if I thought it would do any good. Wow. They could do a documentary about you, couldn't they? Woman addicted to engagements. This is different. Yeah. Yeah. Like it was with Kane. And Michael. And who was before then? Oh, <laughs> yeah, it was Tom. <gasps> this is different. I love Jay. I actually love him. And I want to marry him. I know you think this is a joke, but it's not. Oh, it's brilliant. It is. Absolutely. It just makes me cry every time. Oh. I've known she'd be here. She would just barge past her and knock her off her stool accidentally. <laughs> you right, girls? Can I get you a drink? Laurel? Don't try and sweet talk me just because I'm the vicar's wife. You could have got us all sacked. Well, not you. You weren't even there. <laughs> right. Jenny. Sorry. Do you honestly think I would have gone back to work without you, Laurel? You know, there's a thing called loyalty. Have you ever heard of it? No, you haven't. Some of us need to have a job. We don't all just sponge off the nearest rich bloke. That's not what I was doing, Laurel. Mm. Not anymore. Oi, oh, Laurel. What's going on there? Get me a drink and I'll tell you. Because if I go anywhere near her, I'm going to do something that I'm going to get arrested for. You getting them in, then? Oh, go on, then. It's all right, I'll go, go on. Yeah. Leave her alone. I'll be nice, I promise. Oh, don't bother on our account. Laurel! Well, Jenny, I'm annoyed. <laughs> That's our game we're talking about. Uh, excuse me, I'm still here. Well, there's not going to be a fight, is there? No, I don't like it very much, but still. <laughs> don't start. I'm just getting the drinks in, nothing more. Same again for that lot and get her one. No, thanks. Hey, don't get picky. Nobody else here wants to buy you a drink. I do. Thank you, Chaz. You know I'm only saying that to be supportive. It's not like I'm actually offering you a freebie. Wow, really supportive, thanks. My offer's still on the table. Oh, really? And which one's that, then? Take your pick. You really don't give up, do you? Well, you'd hate it if I did. Didn't take her long. Are you looking for me, G? No. You want to watch her? She's proposing to everyone today. Seeing who's stupid enough to accept. Been there. She proposed. Yeah, it was a joke. Not with me, it wasn't. Charity! You never mentioned that. Whoa, whoa! Huh? Don't even think about it. What? Going after her. It's not you she wants. You know, I almost feel sorry for him. Do you? Nah. He was never going to hang on to her. Well, you and him have a lot in common, though, huh? Well, yeah, except one of us, she can't stay away from. You're gonna sit there all night? Might do. Unless you're planning on barring me. Why don't you go and see Charity? <sighs> stay out of it. Well, I'd love to, because, you see, I'm stuck in the middle. She's my cousin, Kane's my brother, and, well, I don't really care about you. I'm touched. I can see why you're running a mile, though. She does that to people. She just pushes them too far. But you knew what you were getting into with her, so don't try and pretend you weren't expecting trouble. You asked for it. And I'm supposed to just put up with it? I don't know. It depends if you think she's worth it. This day just gets better and better. Peace offering. Classy. Let's make it. What do you want? <clears throat> so, um, you and him, <sighs> it's over then. Do you know what? Get out, because I'm not in the mood. Because proposing? It's a bit desperate, isn't it, even for you? You must really want his money. No, actually, but then I couldn't explain that to you because you just wouldn't get it. Well, try me. 
Okay. Have you ever heard of a thing called love? Well, have you ever married for love? New thing. Thought I might try it, see how it feels. But it didn't work for us. Well, we didn't get that far, did we? Yeah, and you won't with him. Well, he's different. I actually meant it when I proposed. You don't love him? No. I do. You love me. <laughs> well, I did. And then you went and did what you always do. You lost it. Didn't you? And it made me realise how stupid I was to feel anything for you. I hated you when you slept with Faye. I wanted to kill you. You wanted to kill me? Yeah, I fantasised about it. Ripping your heart out, sticking it in my hand, feeling it stop beating Kane, all of... Get out. That's love. I was on my way home from the pub. I've had a few. Right. And all the way back down, I was thinking, this is a big mistake. What is? Me even coming here. So why did you? Because it's doing me head in. What you said, you know, proposing like that, it doesn't make any sense. Well, it does to me. I love you. Don't keep saying that. Why? Isn't it what you want to hear? Only if you mean it. I do. <laughs> and what about my brother? I definitely don't love him. He's all right, I guess. You need to lay off him. Yeah, totally. Because if you ever do anything to him again, I won't forgive you. Not ever. You have my word. <laughs> Not sure that's worth much. <laughs> I mean, if we did get married, could I trust you? Probably not. <laughs> Can't make promises, Jay. And I'm not going to be some stay-at-home, cook your meals, good little wifey. But then isn't that why you love me? Go on, admit it. I should stay away from you. I've always known that. But you can't. Because? Because I love you. And? And what? Fine, I just have to ask you again then, won't I? Will you, Jay Sharma, man I love, marry me? If I must. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs>